My name is Mark and I've been a cameraman working in news and drama and documentary for over 20 years. I've been employed by broadcasters, independent companies to train journalists and producers over the last 10 years. We've been using the 200, PMW 200 for five years since it first came out in 2013 um, and the cameras were starting to show their age and obviously technology is moving all the time so for ITV News and indeed for STV News they're looking at replacing them with something that gives them the ability to be able to connect directly and send clips immediately um, while still being very similar to the 200 camera. So what we were looking for is a camera that was easy for the journalists to be able to upgrade to but still had all the features and new features that they could use. Having worked with a 280 for over a year now, um, what I particularly like is the fact that the quality of the pictures coming out of the camera is better than previous cameras even though I've been using it in HD, not in 4K yet. But simple things like the 10 assign buttons where you can assign functions to having a digital zoom which doesn't lower the quality of the pictures, having a variable ND gives you that creative ability to give you a really narrow depth of field and also having a simple thing like four white balance presets. When I was giving advice to ITV News and STV about what camera to upgrade to, uh, another reason for selecting the 280 was it uses the same bulletproof SPS cards, which I've been using for five years with no issues at all, and the same camera batteries. So we, we upgraded the cameras, but we didn't have to upgrade the whole process and all the equipment that we had that we, was still usable. And also the 280 gave us that end-to-end -end workflow that we wanted to keep. We were looking to upgrade the radio mics and the fact that 280, unlike the earlier models of Sony camera, had an MI shoe bracket on the handle so we could actually power the radio mics from the camera battery um, gave us the ability to use two channels of radio mic but also power them from the camera. There's a lot of exciting network functions available now on the 280. You can shoot full res clips and proxy clips and select which you want to send uh, either through an app on your phone and trim them or indeed straight from the camera to a, a cloud server like Sony C. So it gives you that instant ability to get clips out of the camera um, back into a newsroom or into an edit environment. In a, in a run and gun situation where you can just grab the camera and you know you're getting good quality and it's all in one package makes such a big difference. So, you know, it's a very exciting, good camera for that very reason.